What's up? What's good? It's your girl Courtney B here and I'm back with yet another video. For today's look, I am partnering up with Beauty Forever Hair to bring you guys yet again another quick and easy tea part slay. Now you guys know that tea parts are very limited with the lace being very, very minimal. You barely have anything to play with, anything to pluck. So today I want to bring you guys another little spice up on the little tea part play. And that's going to be a half up, half down, a little nice little curly bang. Now listen. I did not wash this wig at all during this install only because I was trying to see if the factory curls or factory waves would do me justice when styling this hair and it would have if they were all a little bit more uniform so I advise you guys if you do try this style you can actually go ahead and just wash the wig and then just use your wand curler because I ended up using a wand curler anyway for the bang I just parted out directly where the track met the rest of the hair just so that way the hair will fall over and cover that little area because since this is a middle part t-part wig it is surrounded by track you only have a little sliver enough to make a middle part so that was just perfect when it came to my bangs I twisted those bangs up and clipped them out of the way and now we're gonna work on getting this hair up into a ponytail this probably was the hardest part of the whole tutorial because y'all know my hands are a little afflicted I'm not very <laughs> hand and eye coordinated so this ponytail maybe took me maybe like two three four five six seven okay i'm being dramatic a couple of tries but um on here it looks like i may have got it right but trust me honey your girl was on the struggle bus off of camera now i'm gonna go ahead and start trying to cut these ear tabs these ear tabs were a little bit hard to cut i'm not gonna lie um only because since the rest of the wig is track um it wasn't as stretchy and wasn't as easy to cut i felt like i was cutting into the actual wig which didn't really mess up the wig construction but letting you guys know that it is going to be a little bit hard to cut your ear tabs probably because i had the wig kind of tied on my head but either way it goes just be careful when cutting your ear tabs time <laughs> rest of the install is just me curling the back that is down and of course the ponytail and my bangs and that's pretty much it i did not use any spray any glue i didn't spray down anything i want this to be a very quick and easy install because i've been getting a lot of comments and a lot of dms actually wanting quicker more easy and efficient styles to do not everyone is into hot combing not everyone is into pressing this out or pressing that out and i understand that so this video is catering to you guys i heard you guys and trust me i do listen um i did actually add powder though that you guys will see later on in the clips to the middle part just to define everything without plucking because you cannot pluck this part either if you do you will run the high risk of exposing your track and you know we do not want that And yeah, you guys, that is pretty much the whole install. I really, really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please do not forget to give your girl a big thumbs up. And of course, subscribe to the Beehive down below. Join the Beehive gang, the Beehive fam, because we are lit. We are never, ever. Bougie over here, do you understand me? Now you want to keep in contact with your girl because I'm your best friend. You're my best friend. We're all best friends. So add your girl on Instagram. A big, big, big thank you to Squat to Beauty Forever Hair for helping me bring you guys today's look. I am in love with this unit. And as always, I love every single one of you. But until next time, my lovelies, your crown may tilt, but you never let it fall. Stay gilded.